Good morning, everyone. Today is the 14th of April, 2021. As many as you know, I was brought up under the holiness doctrine of perfection, John Wesley. John Wesley read the mystics and really he was practicing Catholicism because he was into works. He believed that man was justified by works. God had a big score uh, chart and was mar marking off good when you were good and when you were bad. And pretty much if your good works outweighed your bad works, then you might make it to heaven. That's the way I was brought up. And so it's been quite a last, I'm 67, and God began to reveal grace to me when I was 37. It's been 30 years, hard to believe, 30 years of God's marvelous grace being revealed to me through his word. Anyone that says that they have not backslid, or in other words, they have uh, succumbed to sin, they're lying through their teeth. I'm not promoting antinomianism. I'm, I am telling you the truth. I have seen his ways and will heal him. I will lead him also and restore comforts unto him and to his mourners. Come now and let us reason together, saith the Lord. Though your sins be as scarlet, they shall be as white as snow. Though they be red like crimson, they shall be as wool. Return ye backsliding children, and I will heal your backslidings. Have you ever backslid? I know I have, and anyone that says they haven't, again, is lying. Behold, we come unto thee, for the, thou art the Lord our God. I will hear what God the Lord will speak, for he will speak peace unto his people and to his saints. But let them not turn again to folly. Bless the Lord, O my soul, and forget not all his benefits who forgiveth all thine iniquities, who healeth all thy diseases. He restoreth my soul. I will praise thee, though thou wast angry with me, thine anger is turned away, and thou comfortest me. Hold thou me up, and I shall be safe. I, even I, am he that blotteth out thy transgressions for mine own sake, and will not remember thy sins. I just read from Psalm 51, 12, Isaiah 57, 18, Isaiah 1, 18, Jeremiah 3, 22, Psalm 85, 8, Psalm 103, 2, and 3, Psalm 23, 3, Isaiah 12, 1, Psalm 119, 117, and Isaiah 43, 25. Isn't it good to know that God is forgiven all of our sins, our past, our present, and our future sins that we'll yet commit if we're one of his. We have the imputed righteousness of Jesus Christ. And he's the one that grants his people repentance. God bless.